L'chalachenu b'nei Yisrael. We're living in an epoch, or as the Brits say, in an epoch, which is unparalleled as far as we can see in, in history. And we have to understand that, albeit it's very uncomfortable to be Machal Shabbos, what I'm going to tell you is not Chil Shabbos. As Rab Chaim Brisky used to say, he was very, very much, as we would say colloquially, Mekel in Yoni Shabbos for the sake of Pikuach Nefesh. And he used to say, I'm not Mekel in Shabbos, I'm Machmer in Pikuach Nefesh. And Pikuach Nefesh st stands high above all the other mitzvahs of the Torah except for the Gimel Averis Chamuris and Chil Hashem. Rabbi Sai, there's no doubt in my mind that for those people who need to fight their habits, which which is a lush and a kia, but if they, if they're in that matzav where they have to share their problems with others, and in all these situations, there are gedorim of pikuach nefesh. Therefore. It's permitted to use all these machineries, so to speak, the Zoom and everything else, in order to stay in touch only because mitam pikuach nefesh. I am incidentally very strongly against people who want to make the Seder with this Zoom or any other contraption. That's Shalai Kalacha. We're talking about pikuach nefesh. However, What's very important to know is that everything that you do should be done with a shinui, which takes it out of the realm of Deiraisa. And you will be instructed exactly how the shinuyim will work, and please conform to everything that you're instructed to do. And the Rabbeinu Shleimah will send us, send us the Gula Shleimah, the Meher of Yemenu Amen. To all my friends, we have just heard from the great Poisik Herb David Cohn that anyone who's facing a challenge, be it an addiction, someone in recovery, an abuse victim, or someone facing a mental health crisis, and they feel the need to maintain their clinical care, be it speaking to their sponsor, continuing with support, with support groups, or continuing to, to, to participate in a 12-step meeting, they are permitted to do so even on Shabbos and Yontiv, as the Poisik Herb David Cohn quoted for Abchaim Brisker, we are machmer on Pekuach Nefesh. In these times when the only way to have this communication is by Zoom or by using the phone to call a sponsor or support line, it is considered Pekuach Nefashis and one can do so. If there's a matter of Pekuach Nefashis, which means right now you're in the situation of Pekuach Nefashis and every single person knows exactly what that means, he or she can pick up the phone, call their sponsor, the mental health professional or Amudim Anonymous support line at 888-726-8346 or 718-972-3000. If it's a question of prevention, and a person needs to participate in the Zoom or a phone meeting to maintain sobriety and stability. He or she is allowed to use Zoom or similar, to, or similar technology on Shabbos or Yontem, and it's not a question of Chil Shabbos or Yontem, because that is also considered Kof Nefashis and is Deich Shabbos, as we just heard from David Kohn. But in that case, when it's prevention to participate in the Zoom meeting, then it should be done with a Shinu while the person is logging in, which means if the person, he or she, is a righty, they should use their left hand, preferably a finger or a knuckle. If that's impossible because they cannot swipe with their finger or knuckle, then they can use just the alternative hand. If he or she is a righty, they should use their left hand. Left hand. If he or she is a lefty, they should use their right, right hand. Again, that is a question of prevention when a person's mental health professional or ombudsman feels they should participate in whatever meeting they have to participate. If it's a question of real pukuch nefashis, and every person knows exactly what that means, they shouldn't hesitate and call the proper place where they have to call. I wish everybody in Kal Yisrael a lot of siyat d'shmaya nachal sadas, and anyone who is struggling and overcoming any addiction, victim or abuse, or those with mental illness should not think twice and be in touch with their sponsor, mental health professional, or call on with them right away and deal with their, with their crisis appropriately. I wish you all a safe and chag kosher v'sameach.